Look at this lovely 1989 Mercedes-Benz 300 SE. It's a W126 and this particular car is an update. My name is Philip Tarrant and I'm going to have a chat to you about this car today. It's a 1989 model. The update brought with it soft leather interior which is foam sprung as opposed to having the old springs. It's got a driver's airbag and it's got an electric steering column as well. It was one of the first cars in the world to have an airbag and an electric steering column. It's got fully electric seats. It's got the very reliable four-speed gearbox and it comes in Armadine with cream leather interior. It's done 157,000 kilometres and it's in remarkable condition. If you look at this driver's seat, there's no scratches, the paint's not wearing off, it's unbelievable. The armrest also tends to crack and the same goes for the dash. So it's a car which we think has definitely been garaged for a lot of its life. I think it's a fantastic colour combination compared to silver with grey or silver with black or whatever it may be. It's a short wheelbase but you've still got quite a bit of room in the back there. The leather in the back is excellent. If the leather in the front's good it's going to be even better in the back. The power windows work well. It's got a very good service history to it. I used to have one of these or actually I've had a few of these and uh, I've driven this car overnight and it drives particularly well. The air conditioning is nice and cold and it just handles beautifully. I quite like the 300 engine. It's a straight six and it loves to be revved and they actually go quite well. You do need to use quite a bit of throttle. With most of these cars you tend to get rust below the back window. Because this car's been garaged, as I mentioned, it's got no rust in all the usual spots whatsoever. You usually even just get like a tiny little flake there, but it's just excellent, absolutely excellent. So that's one of the first things we look at here at the Old Timer Centre. I'll have a quick look at the spare. Yeah, it's got an alloy spare, full-size spare as they all did. The car came to us with mud flats. We've taken them off because we think they look a lot better without. After all, I don't think it's a car which is going to be driven in the country. Another benefit of this particular car is it hasn't got the chrome wheel arches. You can certainly add them later if you wish, but unfortunately if they've been on the car for a long period of time, that's the arches around here, you tend to have two different colours and they can rust underneath as well because they get dirt and things. So this car has not had those either. Look at that leather, it's just so soft. Unbelievable. The hood lining's in very good condition. I can't see any dents in the car whatsoever. And um, yeah, really, overall it's a very nice car. It's just come in. We, we are going to do some touch-ups on the bumpers and things. Just a couple little marks from parking, etc. The wood grain is excellent. As I said, the dash has no cracks in it whatsoever. It really is a beautiful car. And it's so rare to get cars like this with under 200,000 kilometres now. If you have a look, some of them have got 400, 500, 300,000 Ks. I think the average has about 250 to 300. So this is well below the average. And as I said, it does have a, a very nice colour combination to it. So if you are looking for a W126, you want something which isn't going to use too much fuel and require a lot of maintenance. You can't go past something like this. The three litre six cylinder is very, very good. We recently sold a 420 SEL V8, also in incredible condition with low kilometres, which is good for us because it's, it's quite rare to see cars in this condition with genuine low kilometres, Australian delivered with good log books. And we've had two in the past couple of months, which we're quite excited about. But if you'd like to come in and have a look, any inspection welcome. We think this is a very good example of the W126 series, and we certainly welcome the opportunity to take you for a test drive.
We are the Alzheimer's Center, and thank you.